It's my pleasure to introduce at this time Alec Moore, class of 2011. I'd like, to, I'd like to begin by saying that I feel very privileged to speak on behalf of students and student athletes at this dedication and by thanking members of the Grinnell administration for this great honor. Like, me, like most students, I applied to Grinnell largely for its academic reputation, but I would not have come to this institution unless I had met the people I had through athletics. I distinctly remember Grinnell's tennis coach, Andy Hamilton, calling me in the evening just a few days after I had completed the prospective student athlete survey online. His obvious attempt to connect with me on a more personal level than other coaches who seemed to simply refer me back or seemed content simply referring me back to their website is a great example of the genuine people and relationships that make us Grinnell. What I didn't expect as a high school senior was the degree to which this interaction and later becoming a student athlete in college would alter, my, alter and expand my views and about the purpose of higher education and my own future. For example, about a decade ago or so, members of the tennis team started, started a tradition known as 10S, literally the number 10, a dash, and the letter S. By itself, 10S appears like nothing more than a clever play on words that lacks any real need for association with a concept like tradition. But just like my first interactions with Coach Hamilton, this, tr this tradition goes beyond just playing tennis on the court. It represents, it represents the deep personal bonds and lasting friendships that are formed of people of diverse beliefs, dreams, backgrounds, and intellectual processes work together to accomplish their goals. This year alone was filled with numerable, memorable instances that illustrated the ability of teamwork through friendship to help realize great achievements. For example, this year we won team the team conference title for the seventh straight year, earning us a bid to team nationals. We had a senior win his 11th conference title, and we had a junior captain qualify for individual nationals, which has only been done twice in recent memory. Personally, I will always remember his trip to, to individual, the individual national tournament, not because of the physical sport of tennis, but because of the people who made the long journey with me to support our friend and teammate. Yet the type of connection that tennis symbolizes is not something simply created on the tennis court through competition and match play. It is continually shaped over time by the changing face of the team and the academic and worldly experiences of its members. Since joining the team, I've witnessed more selfless commitment to social service and dedication to personal dreams than I had in, in my 18 years prior to attending Grinnell. And it has been my experiences maturing, maturing in the security of this athletic team and with the remarkable individuals that it attracts that have pushed me to achieve academically to, to strive for my potential in all aspects of my life and to become something more than my salary when I graduate. It is my hope that these amazing new facilities will continue to foster the sort of personal bonds that I've formed while a student athlete at Grinnell, provide teams with an arena fitting of their success, and expose the campus community to individuals, particularly student athletes, with unique perspectives and new ways, new ways of approaching challenges who continue Grinnell ideals of progressive thought and pioneering feats in the classroom and on the field. Thank you.